Following the passing of Matthew Perry, the beloved, friends, actor, his philanthropic legacy continues to resonate. Legal documents obtained by Entertainment Tonight reveal that Perry, prior to his demise, allocated over $1 million in assets to a living trust. This trust, known as the Alby Singer Living Trust, pays homage to the character portrayed by Woody Allen in the iconic 1977 film Annie Hall. While Perry's overall net worth exceeded the $1 million earmarked for the trust, this allocation represents the assets he had readily available at the time of his passing. The beneficiaries named in the trust include Perry's parents, John Perry and Suzanne Morrison, along with his half-sister, Caitlin Morrison. Additionally, a non-blood-related beneficiary named Rachel Dunn is listed. Managing the affairs of the Alvey Singer Living Trust are two female executors, Lisa Ferguson and Robin Risen. The legal proceedings regarding the trust have been initiated by Ferguson's attorney. Matthew Perry's untimely demise occurred on October 28, 2023, when he was discovered deceased in his Los Angeles residence, specifically in his bathtub. The death certificate, with Perry's stepfather, Keith Morrison, identified as the informant, indicates that the identification to authorities was facilitated by the prominent Dateline host. A coroner's report released in December identified the cause of Perry's death as the acute effects of ketamine, a substance known for its anesthetic properties. This revelation sheds light on the circumstances surrounding Perry's passing, offering closure to his fans and loved ones. Despite his departure, Matthew Perry's generosity and commitment to philanthropy endure through his charitable bequests. The establishment of the Alvey Singer Living Trust ensures that his legacy of giving back to those closest to him and those in need lives on, embodying the spirit of compassion and altruism that defined his life and career.